Hello, I'm Ed Trillisium, and welcome to Dyson Sphere Program, where we're going to have a look at a particular mod today that I think is, well, highly important. In fact, so much so that I cannot wait for it to become core functionality, because it just will. But, for now, it is our only solution, and that is copy inserters. What does copy inserters do, you might ask? Well, uh, if you've ever set up a huge array of smelters, you're very much used to having to put down about a million different inserters because you cannot copy them across when you copy buildings. Well, no longer. This mod actually allows you to, when you copy a building, it copies all the inserters. So, for instance, if we were going to set up a huge array of smelteries, um, let's just put a smelter here. And we'll say, hey, your job is to make iron ingots. And then our output belt can go here. Um, let's just use normal inserters. Cool. Great. You're doing a good job there. But obviously we want to put more down. Well, we just shift copy and it will copy with the inserters. And we can keep doing this. And look how much time it will save. This is honestly the revelatory. Um, obviously, I need to put down power poles. But that is going to save so much time when you're setting up huge arrays. I cannot begin to describe how amazing this mod is. That's one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Uh, we will need a few more. Now, one two, three. If you put them down without the tracks there, it won't actually put down the rest, so we're going to have to put down things manually. However, let's just delete you. Put down that, and then again, one, two, three. And again, inserters are done. And it does it properly. You'll see that they've actually got, like, drones have to go put them out. Um, they actually seem to graphically place in the correct location. That is something that the mod didn't do, uh, at least until a recent update. The actual inserts would kind of graphically be weird, but they would still work. And that is just as simple as it is. Now, if we wanted to try and extend this and be like, hey, well, can we make, can we make cogs? Let's try using a fabricator. Um, come on, little fabricator. So... We'll say you make cogs from iron ingots. And then output. And then we'll just do that. Great. Copy. Copy. And you'll see that, yeah, the inserters have all copied over properly. And it's as simple as that. Extend it again. Copy. Done. It's that simple. Now, one thing that was broken, uh, that might still be broken, so let's actually just double check this, is inserting directly from machine into another machine. In fact, let's just use a chain for that. So, if we try and insert directly from, say, this smeltery into a... Um, uh, let's actually just delete this row. There we go. And we'll delete the last one there as well. Okay. So, uh, the one that I'm talking about is, say, if we were trying to make steel. So, we will want... Smelter. I don't know what you call them, smelteries. There. And then we'll want to put in another beam of belts. And then we want you to be steel. Okay. And obviously, we're going to need to provide power for these, so we'll do that as well. So, if we would copy you down to here, this should copy fine. Yep. And then one thing that was broken until recently, I don't know if it's still broken, is if we copy this with an inserter that actually tries to pull from another machine. 
Oh, that's been fixed. Okay, so no longer is this a bug. It used to crash the game. You can now... That's it. That's done. That's a full array of steel smelters. That simply... That's brilliant. That is incredibly quick. This used to be broken, I think, like as of maybe yesterday, as of when I'm recording this. This is just going to save so much time. This mod is probably not long away from being core functionality. Whether it is just copying, includes the actual inserters, or whether it's copying some sort of blueprint, I suspect inserters will become part of it. Because if it's this simple to make the mod, it will become core functionality. It is brilliant. It saves a lot of time. As always, be cautious when using mods with an early access title in case it breaks anything. But in theory, these are things that exist in the game. They aren't adding any new actual objects or buildings. So my guess is that this will be save compatible when the game updates and changes. However, it is possible it won't be. Bear that in mind. It is early access title. It is updating regularly. If you want the mod still, though, uh, go to dsp.thunderstore.io. Yes, DSP already has its own modding portal. And then get the uh, mod manager, the R2 mod manager. Download that, and then through that, you can get copy inserters, which is the mod. And it's that simple. Download that have it installed and then shift copy will do your thing it's fantastic i thoroughly recommend this mod i cannot wait for it to be core functionality but until then we have it so um that's all i've got to say about this it works copying things includes both the setting as normal and also the inserters and that saves so much time so much repetitive clicking this just makes me so happy. Okay, uh, I thoroughly recommend this mod. Bear in mind, early access, so use it at your discretion. But it's going to save so much time. I've been Andrew Lissim. Hopefully you've enjoyed it. If you have, if you found this useful or insightful, or you've liked the look of the mod, um, and you want me to do more, give me a comment, give me a like, uh, subscribe if you want, and go check out the actual uh, Discord we have at Linktree down below in the uh, section. There will be a link to the mod manager. I've been Andrew Lissim, and stay shiny.